Kaira, we are going to read a very interesting book today. Do you know yeah. the name? Uh, yeah. yeah, The Boy the Who boy. Talked All Day. It's written by? Linda, Linda Locke. Locke. Okay. Have you read this one before? Uh, no. No? Okay. The Boy Who Talked All Day. Do you know anyone who can, who wants to or who like to talk all day? Me. You. So, I think this one will be very interesting. There was a young boy who talked all day. He talked so much that he forgot to play. Sometimes he liked to talk to the squirrels in the trees, sitting with a tatty fat rat on his knees. Oh, this one looks like your hamster, right? <laughs> Such a cute one. He talked about the future. He talked about the past. He talked about riding on his bicycle, bicycle. and made everybody gasp. Very nice. He once talked so much that he plainly didn't see a swarm of angry buzzing bees in time to flee. How buzzing bees sound? Bzzz. Bzzz. Is it nice? No. No? Disturbing. Very disturbing. Okay. He loved to he loved to jibber jabber about his idea sublime, especially all the tall mountains that he would climb. Do you love to climb a mountain? I would like to because I've never yeah. tried. Never tried? Yeah. Okay, we'll try that one day. He didn't stop yakking, even taking a nap. The cat couldn't stand it and hid under a hat. Imagine someone talking like for the whole day and whole night. Not even I talk <laughs> that much. <laughs> when walking past a school and practicing in a hall, he started his noisy nattering, what an odd ball. Imagine everyone doing this yeah. practice. He, he talked before school, he talked after school, he talked walking home and slipped in some poo. Oh no, slip on some poo. That is mm. very disgusting. Very disgusting. This person should clean up after a dog. Right. Okay, let's ask everyone. So what do you think would have happened after this? 